Three months ago, I interviewed Brian Park, a man who'd built the world's smallest football stadium, on top of his head. I caught up with Brian to see how things were going. I've got a bloody Tesco Express on my head. How do you think they're going? But what happened to Brian Park Stadium? Well, unfortunately, I ran into some financial difficulties. Because of the economy, I was struggling to sell tickets. I just couldn't get people in through the doors. The doors were tiny. In the end, I had to sell off the land to pay my debts. That is a shame to have to part with such prime forehead real estate. And on top of all that, I was battling with an addiction. What were you addicted to, Brian? Was it alcohol? Cracks to see? No. Football stickers. One night I spent three grand on a 1986 mint condition Alan Hansen sticker. <laughs> Alan Hansen! So what will you do now, Brian? I don't know. Brian Park Stadium has gone, along with my dreams of immortality. I've got nothing now. Chin up, Brian. I, I bet that's the world's smallest Tesco Express on top of your head. Do you think so? Absolutely. Well, that's something special, isn't it? Y yeah. Sort of.